Welcome back to the channel guys, this is Lonely Valley Case. I haven't recorded for like a whole week because I just got this new mic. I ordered it on a Sunday and it came on a Saturday. Well, the most recent Saturday, which is a few days ago. It's the BM800. I heard it's really good for people who aren't like like enthusiastic about mics and just kind of getting into it. And I'm not really good with mics, so this is a good option for me. Very budget friendly as well. I hope you can tell the difference between this one and the previous one. The previous one was just my my phone mic so i'm still messing around the settings trying to get a good balance of how to use this mic better so uh forgive me if the audio is a bit rough for you and uh, hopefully give me give me some tips in the comment section as to how i can prove it right on to the video new call lonely valley residents ask for help investigating a strange house Res residents are reporting screams and other strange things near this house apparently the house is empty for now So, okay, we are walking into the camera. 007 style. I should move this. I'm also just in the middle of the screen. Only Valley case. From what I've seen, it looks a bit like the other game I played called At the Wrong Place. I think that's the right name for it. But uh, yeah, I played that game. That game was also quite fun. So I'm hoping this is kind of similar to that. Press W to accelerate. I wonder if I stop pressing W. Oh, the car just stops. I thought it was one of those things where you just click it once and then it kind of goes on by itself. I can't go on. The path is too bumpy. Now I need to get the cones from the trunk of the car and put them on the street. That's quite responsible because a lot of people just leave the car in the middle of the road. Like in the previous one at the wrong house, he just left his car in the middle of the road and just kind of dipped afterwards. So, yeah, get the cones, I guess. Oh, we're at the house now. Let's go into it. To the haunted house we go. It's locked, I need to find a way to get in. Oh god, how do I. Uh, what the heck? What? Excellent, this could be a way. In. You want to go through the vent? What the hell? There's a like a pile of flesh here. This is not human meat, is it? Here's the thing, what would you have done if it was? Like this you kind of entered the house already, you kind of cursed yourself. There's there's nothing you could do now. They said except accept your fate here. Fate fate. What did I say fate? That was weird. Is that a hatchet? I want that. Eh, give me. No. It's not giving it to me. It's blocked, I need something to open it. Can I take this and kind of break it? See to be something inside, yeah. Oh, it's the key. I thought it was, there was something that I could use to kind of break the lock. Okay, wait, why is the key inside the room that's locked in? What? Uh, oh, I want to go there. There's a whole huge pile of flesh here. Oh, is, what is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, this crowbar can be used to it. What? Wait, was that thing a crowbar as well? What is the other thing then? Was it just some kind of like something just stuck in it? Cool, I guess. I don't know what I'm using crowbar for. I mean, I can knock someone out with it. Uh, I've <laughs> found a use for it already. Uh, let me try to go here first and see what happens. This has no energy, so it doesn't work. It has no energy. Oh, oh wait, that's a fuse box, right? There's a lot of blood on that fuse box, but we can ignore that. Hey, the lights are back on. So that's what I need. I need the lights to be back on for the door to open. Ah, that's the energy. Alright, onto the door. Wait, how are these lit up then? The place didn't have any power to it. What? Unless it has like preserve energy, like its own generator for those specific purposes. Uh, let's go. Oh, okay. That, uh, I don't know if you should follow that or not, but you know me, the, the explorer out here. Oh, there's the dead guy. Yo, who is that guy right over there? What? Oh, it's so creepy. Oh, there's no shit. I haven't lost track of time, but I already knew that I've been here for a long time. Every day he kills someone. Maybe the next one will be me. 
think that was the same guy. Hmm. Horrible things happened here. There was like a huge pile of flesh that we walked past twice. And why are you only noticing this now? I, you know what? Better late than never. Uh, can I take that? Is that a knife? I, I want that. Can I have that? Nope. It doesn't want to give me. There seems to be something behind that bookshelf. Oh, is it some kind of note telling me I'm gonna die? Oh, watch it moves. Secret passageway. Oh, wait, get out of here. D get out of here. No, I'm trapped. There's no cinema in the room. Oh, can I? Is these candle holders have some kind of like lever kind of thing where I can kind of open this wall? Nope, just normal candle holders. Not everything has a secret. I'm tired. This creature has been chasing me for months. He, take, he makes me kill a lot of people to feed his bloodlust. Now I'm tired. But in exchange for peace, I'd have to give my life. If we this, get out of here immediately. I shall take your advice, my good man. Oh god. I hate these types of stuff. It's like Resident Evil where the transition between the rooms is like the door and kind of has a similar vibe. It always creeps me out because there's always things like something's just gonna pop out from one of those things. It's so creepy. I love it so much though. Like this type of stuff, like if the door doesn't open, something just pops up. But obviously nothing's gonna happen now. Oh. Okay, I can't move. Thanks for playing. This is a project for future and thanks for the support. Wait for the continuation. Alright, that was fun. It was a good little demo. I'm looking forward to the continuation of this as well. I'm also waiting for the at the wrong place, the second part of that. Because these two kind of have the same kind of vibe or similar kind of vibe, which is really good. So uh look forward to the next episode of this if it comes out. I right, see you guys. Bye.